Hello, everybody. Hi. What's going on? Well, we got two packages. Two packages? Two packages of what? Some Disney pins. Disney pins? What do you mean, Disney pins? Tell me more. <clears throat> well, I bought some Disney pins. So, uh, this is a Shop Disney. Mm -hmm. um, What's Shop uh, Disney? It's the, like the Disney store, but online. I don't, oh. I don't really know what it is. That seems like a pretty big box you got down there. Uh, well, I don't know. Mm. And then this was a park pickup. So, someone went to the parks and picked me up some pins. Ooh, mystery pins. Well, I know what's in there. Oh, they actually went to the park and picked them up? Yes, because Disney does their stupid exclusive at the park thing where uh, you need to like go to the park to actually pick up the pin. Oh, stupid Disney. And, like, mm -hmm. a lot of people don't have time for that. So mm -hmm. Cut. there are people who exclusively go to the park to pick up pins for other people and mail them out. Awesome. So that was cool. So thank you, Mike. Did he pick up something specific for you? Yes, I, I said something specific. Ooh. So let's... Uh, Which park did he get it at? One of the four Florida ones. Oh, it's all the way from Florida? Yeah. Wow. That's cool. So it's a Disney Park exclusive in Florida. And you got this package from who? Mike. Uh, and the mailing address is from Pennsylvania. Oh, wow. So I'm... Not opening this right. Oh, thanks Mike from Pennsylvania or Florida. We'll put your link in the description. So today we're going to be unpackaging our first pin trade on video. Isn't that exciting everyone? Yeah. Yeah, we're really looking forward to it. It's been a really, really exciting trade this time. Um, did you have to trade anything for this? I didn't trade anything. My traders are very small. Slow, or I don't have very many. Oh, you have a small pool of traders. Well, once you get multiple, do you want to get something else? <gasps> All right, so first I got a Marvel, the Marvel Kawaii Series 2 pack. Ooh. And there are 14 different people on here. So the first one's had like um, Captain America, She-Hulk, Captain Marvel. Mm -hmm. And this one has the Guardians, so it has um, Groot and Star Lord and Gamora, um, Doctor Strange, mm -hmm. um, Ant Man, Falcon. Oh, they're so, pretty good set. Yeah, Nebula too. Ooh, have and, you, do you have any of those? No, I just wanted this. Um, this is a five. You get five pins in the pack. Five of them. Wow. Yeah, each pack contains five randomly pin selected pins. So, um, out of those characters, who would you want? Uh, I think that Doctor Strange is one of my favorite characters. Yeah. Um, I think Wasp is actually pretty cool. Uh, Vision's kind of cool. That Vision? That is Vision. Yeah. Who would I get? Um, Ant-Man and Ant-Man and... I don't want five Ant-Mans. Maybe Groot. The, yeah, Rocket and Groot and Ant-Man. Yeah, I thought I didn't have you Okay, so Rocket, Groot, Ant-Man... Doctor Strange and Wasp. Mm -hmm. Wait. And Vision. So, wait, that's six. There's the other ones too. Like, Gamora looks cool. Um, who else is there? Nebula that? looks really cool, though. Nebula. Nebula is like a new fan favorite for a lot of people because yeah. she's a sort of villain, anti hero kind of thing. I don't know. Oh, Black I think I'd be too. happy with most of these. I don't want to put into the universe the ones that I don't want. So. Uh huh. Uh, should we start opening? Yeah. Okay. I actually like um, Ronan the Accuser. It's pretty cool. Okay, so they're not in little baggies. So the first one is uh, Drax. <gasps> Drax. Ooh, oh look, he's so kawaii. What is he? Oh, wow. That is pretty, pretty cute. cute. He's pretty cute. That's good. Uh, yeah, hi Drax. What's up, yo? Yo, yo, that's cool. Yeah. Super cute. And then um, it doesn't have the Mickey uh, back head, which was weird. Uh, but here's the back. Mmm, I see, I see. Oh, 
Oh yeah, and Mickey's, there's a Mickey pattern in the middle. Yeah, this this is supposed to be a Mickey head, the backer. Oh, the backer, the yeah, backer pin. The backer pin. pin is just a little... A nubbin. Yeah. I see. Okay. And it says, uh, pin trading 2020. All right, great. First pin. Let's see. Star-Lord! Star-Lord! Ooh, hi, Star-Lord. I wonder if I need like an autofocus. There you go. Cool, I like it. Yeah, like it's that. really cool. Oh. I really liked, um, who's it, Chris Pratt. Chris who, Pratt. Who uh, did Star-Lord in the movies. Cool, I found a new function. You hit this button and it automatically doubles in. Gamora! Gamora! Ooh, I wonder! This is gonna be an interesting set. Ooh, hey, Gamora. Yo, Gamora, yo! Oh, whoa, that is cool. Ooh. Got the purple hair. Uh-huh, she's got a gun. Is that a gun? Maybe? I thought no. it was a sword. She's supposed to be have a sword, so maybe it's a sword gun. Gun sword. Number four is... <gasps> Rocket! Rocket! Uh, I wonder if there's a theme here, everyone. Oh my god. If this is a theme, the next one has to be Groot. That's so cute! Oh wow. Rocket got some attitude. And then last is... Come on, Groot. Come on, Groot. Come on! It's Ronin. Oh, it's Ronin! <laughs> oh. Hey, why? They have all of the oh, guardians God. except... Groot. Everyone except for so, Groot. All right, so if you have Groot and you want Ronin, you know, let's let's uh, go to a trade. Yeah, let's make a trade. Cool. Oh, wow. Wow, what a cool set. Aside from Groot, missing Groot. Missing Groot, and I didn't get Ant-Man, but mm -hmm. um, that is like almost all of the Guardians, so that's cool. That's cool. And then this other one here, is one of the monthly releases they have at uh, Walt Disney World. Um, and it was the Zodiac set. So this one is Capricorn. So it is uh, the Hunchback. Ooh. Hunchback of Notre Dame. A limited edition. Limited edition. And they'll make one for every month for each Zodiac. Cool. So I'm assuming that each one of them is going to be like a different movie. Uh -huh. um, the first one is Capricorn, and that's um, Hunchback of Notre Dame. Mm -hmm. um, and then they made Aquarius, and that was Little Mermaid. Mm. So let me show you. Is Capricorn for like January? Uh, I guess so. Capricorn runs into January, right? I guess so. I don't so, know. So let me show you. So it says all the zodiacs around it, and then it has a spinner. So it has. Jolly as the <gasps> goat Capricorn oh, in the stars. Wow. Isn't that cool? Capricorn in the stars, that's so cool. And then is the gem anything special? Uh, I don't think so. Um, and then here's the back, it's sort of like a pearlescent um, or iridescent shiny. And it says um, limited edition of 4,000. Ooh, 4,000 of those. Dang, that's nice. Wow. Hey Google, what is the stone of January? Here's what I understood from the website wixenjewelers.com. For babies born in January, the garnet is the perfect gemstone to represent their birthstone. Do you want a little more context? No. Oh wow. The spinner's really cute. Love Quasimodo, so I'm trying to build up a Quasimodo uh, Hunchback of Notre Dame collection. And this is my first pin that actually has Quasimodo in it, mm -hmm. and Esmeralda. So it's a nice one. Yeah, this is my third pin that has Jolly on it. So Jolly, because Jolly's so cute. Jolly's cute. I bet that's supposed to represent Garnet. Probably, maybe, probably a birthstone plus the zodiac. Mm -hmm. All right. Disney tissue paper in it. Oh, let's take a closer look at the tissue paper. Oh, there's lots of little nice tissue designs on it. Yeah, let's take a look. Ooh. It's got, uh, from what I can see, Snow White, Lumiere, Elsa, Peter Pan, Pinocchio, Miss Potts, Tinkerbell, Goofy, wow. Bing Bong, Bing Bong, and the Disney Castle. So cool. That's a lot of them. Yeah. 
So I'll put that right here, uh, packing clip. And so the first thing I bought was to um, get my Finding Nemo collection up. Oh. So it's, it's a three for of uh, Finding Nemo pins. Oh, cool. Um, and I thought that these were, um, most of the Finding Nemo pins I've seen online have been really cheesy and like cartoony. Uh-huh. And so I wanted realistic fish. So let's see. Okay, so the first one is Dory. And she says, just keep swimming, just keep swimming. Let's take a look at Dory. Hey, Dory. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. She's adorable. Oh, and the just keep swimming has like gl blue glitter. Oh, she, this is nice. It's realistic. Uh, and the back says Disney pin trading 2021. So this is one of my first 2021. Um, pins. Oh, that's taking a closer thing. Disney pin trading. Where did it say? Oh. Uh, yeah, did you see the Mickey Mouse head? Yeah. They're always oh, so small. Cool. And then the second one is Marlin and Nemo. Oh, it says, You're my Nemo. You're my Nemo. Oh, oh, how cute. Yeah. And these fish look way more realistic than some of the other pins I've seen. I like it. Cool. And the glitter in the Nemo, I didn't realize they had glitter. It looks pretty good with the glitter. Yeah. I like how Marlin is on the pin too. Mm hmm And then the last pin is of Bruce the shark. And I couldn't tell what the like hinge thing did so um, online because uh, it has a hinge, but like they never opened it in the Shop Disney photo. Oh. So uh, this is what it looks like. Not food. <sighs> oh, fish are friends, not food. Yeah, got it. Okay. Got it. Got it. It just was weird that the hinge was never shown open. Like, uh-huh. And then here's it closed. That's cute. Uh, so it is a pin. Oh, it's a hinge pin. Um, 2021. Nice. So that's really cool. Although I kind of would have liked just Bruce as a picture instead of the hinge, but the hinge is always cool. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I'm glad my Finding Nemo collection is getting some like realistic fish. Yeah. And my second booster set is of these, of the Fab Five. Uh, we got Mickey and we got uh, Donald, Pluto, and Chippendale as little sushi rolls. They're, They're so, so cute. cute. Like, I don't really collect these characters, but I had to get them because of the sushi. Yeah. And I'm going to rip it because it wasn't coming off the sticky thing. Okay, let's do Mickey first. So Mickey looks like he's on a Tamago uh, nigiri. Oh. Yeah, and the egg is very glittery. Super glittery, wow. Yeah. Uh, and it, this uh, says pin trading 2021. Gosh, it's like an official thing. So cool. Yeah, oh my gosh, the glitter is so nice. Yay, I love Super having glitter glittery. pins. Yeah. Okay. And then we have Donald, who looks like he's on a tuna roll. Hey, Donald. Donald looks so like chibi, almost like a penguin. Are you sure well, it's Donald? It, it's gotta be Donald. What other duck is there? Is that even a duck? It kind of looks like a penguin. But it, it's, it's gotta be Mickey, Pluto, this has gotta be Donald. Mm. Okay, comment down below who this character is. I believe it's Donald. I think a little bit of okay. Donald. Um. I don't know. Because he has the red bow. He doesn't have the blue hat, but... He's not his characteristic angry self, though. 
Yeah, I guess the blue on the uh, on his jacket isn't like the navy blue, mm -hmm. like because Donald's in the navy. Um, in the navy. <laughs> okay, let's look at Pluto. But Pluto's not a planet anymore. All right, Pluto looks like he's on a fish row. Fish row. Ooh, Tobiko. Yeah, Tobiko roll. Cool. Yep, he's like little chibi and the seaweed is all glitterly. I like it. I like it because the, the seaweed is the glitter, not the fish row. Mm -hmm. So you get some black glitter too. Yeah, black glitter. Okay, where did that go? And last pin is the Chip and Dale pin and they look like they are on little avocado rolls. Hi Jeff, hi Dale. Let me get you zoomed in. Ooh, yeah. Wait, what would you say? That's avocado roll? That? Yeah. I think it's avocado. Yeah. And again, the glitter is on the seaweed. Um, no glitter on the avocado. Nice. They got the different red and brown or black nose. Yeah, Dale has the red nose and Chip has the black nose. Mm -hmm. I never really thought about that until you told me. Uh, so which of the Shop Disney pins? Oh, uh, which of the Shop Disney pins was your favorite? Hmm. Well, I really liked. Let's fly over. Oh, let's take a let's take an overhaul look. Overhaul look of what we got here. Yeah, what a great selection. So many good ones today. Ooh, wow, what a haul. Very nice. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I think, um, I think I'm gonna go with the uh, uh, Marlin and Nemo. Uh-huh, that's a good one. It says, you're my Nemo. Mm-hmm. That was a nice one. I did like that one a lot. I mean, I also like the gold glitter on the Mickey. On the Mickey. The Mickey tuna is really good. Uh-huh. I mean, I really like the Chip and Dale. They're cute. Because they go together. Yeah. Chip and Dale is always really cute. The mystery uh, Guardian of the Galaxy pack. That would have been so cute. good if that Ronin was a Groot. Yeah. <gasps> I, I actually like Ronin. Ronin's cool. And so he's a just terrible villain. I might... I might need to get another pack so I can trade them for Ant-Man and Wasp and um, Doctor Strange uh -huh. and Groot. Yes. You gotta need a Groot to finish out the thing. You definitely need a Groot for this. Mm-hmm. Who knows, maybe someone needs a Ronin and you just need a Groot. Yep. That would be very cool. And then you just compliment each other all day. Hmm? You compliment each other all day. I am Groot. Yeah. Very okay. good, very good. Indeed. Awesome. Did you enjoy your haul today? I did. Which one are you looking forward to most in our next haul? I'm looking forward to what the other Zodiacs are. Uh-huh. Um, I probably won't collect the whole thing, um, but I'll collect either the characters that I like or the Zodiacs that I like. Uh-huh. Very cool. Very cool. I think it's going to be great. Mm-hmm. So this is your first... Uh, uh, buying from the exclusive? Cool. Uh, this isn't my first time buying from him uh, from um, or from Shop Disney, but oh. um, it's the first time that I feel confident enough to make a video. Awesome! Well, there's gonna be a lot more in the future. So comment down below which pin I unboxed was your favorite. Woo! Until next time, my pin traders! Keep collecting. Keep collecting.